Hello, Springbox channel fans. I'm here to bring you some fresh news straight from the backstage of our beloved Bach. It seems we have a hot topic involving local unions and the Springbok test fees. Let's dive into this story together and understand all sides of this intense debate. Don't forget to leave your like if you love rugby and want to stay updated on all the Springbox news. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon for notifications. This way, you won't miss any videos and you'll help strengthen our Bach community. Your subscription is super important for us to keep sharing exciting moments and exclusive news about our team. Get ready for unmissable and thrilling content. Stay tuned and let's cheer together for our beloved Springboks. Now, let's dive into today's updates. Do you know about those exciting matches coming up? The Springboks will face Ireland, the All Blacks, and Argentina, along with the historic test against Portugal. But what's causing a stir are the fees charged to the local unions to host these games. Do the local unions have a point in being dissatisfied with these high fees? According to information from the Report newspaper, the cost for the local unions are hefty. The Lions, Western Province, Bulls, Sharks, Pumas, and Cheetahs are having to shell out amounts ranging from 5 million Brazilian reals to 20 million Brazilian reals to host these electrifying matches. What do you think about the fees charged by SA Rugby? Is it hindering the games, or is it fair to maintain the quality of the spectacle? Share your opinions below. The situation is so tense that local union leaders are even considering seeking legal support to deal with this issue. They question the decisions of SARA's main council made in 2020, claiming that the budget models did not anticipate these extra fees for 2024. Both SA Rugby and the unions have their arguments in this financial standoff. While SA Rugby argues that the fees are part of the budget to maintain the quality of the games, the unions want more clarity and perhaps changes in the rules of the game. In this debate around the Springbok test fees, it's crucial to remember that, in addition to the importance of player health and safety, we must also consider the economic and social impact these decisions may have. By ensuring that the tests are accessible to everyone involved in rugby, we are not only protecting the integrity of the sport but also promoting inclusion and diversity in our community. As dedicated fans of the Springboks, we should come together in support of a sustainable and welcoming environment for all players, regardless of their background or financial situation. By supporting measures that aim to balance safety and accessibility, we are strengthening not only our team, but also the core values that South African rugby represents. Let's move forward with empathy and awareness, seeking solutions that benefit everyone and strengthen the collective spirit of rugby. Together, we can build a more just and vibrant future for our beloved sport. Let's embrace diversity, promote dialogue, and inspire positive changes on and off the field. Keep supporting our Springbok with passion and commitment, for together we are stronger and capable of achieving great feats.